Hi, uh, what I'm doing is kind of a reminiscent session of a, a toy line that I loved. I did put a video on of small soldiers uh, a long time ago uh, and then I transferred it to this channel. So if you want to look it, you can either watch it on uh, uh, Tom Stone channel or I re put it on to this channel that we're on now. Uh, but uh, I just wanted to, I just found these bits today. It's the die cast vehicle. Got my son to paint with it being chipped. Quite heavy actually. What made me laugh was these figures are plastic. They're really tiny. Obviously it's chip hazard. Uh, it's a great film from the 90s. Do recommend it if you like toys and you like uh, soldiers. It's kind of what you would really wish all your toys would do. And uh, here's the main man. It's a talking chip hazard. Uh, he's missing his pistol, I believe. If he came with two weapons. Uh, I believe I had him with the, the other weapon before. I'll look out for that but when you press you press there on his there and his belt lights up I just thought how cool it would have been you know having a toy that actually well not so much what happens in this film but um the animatronics and everything they put into making it so uh, human orientated it was brilliant the amount of effort you know it wasn't done just on computer it was a lot of work went into it so he's a pretty cool figure he's pretty realistic to what he is in the film uh, it, obviously his arch enemy is Archer and the uh, Gorgonite uh, as I say, if you want to look up my other video of my collection, I did have them. I don't have it now. Stupidly, I sold it. But, uh, yeah, so I was just reminiscing. I just saw her on eBay today. I saw a, a room guard that I used to have. I think that's what set me off about trying to put some new batches in him and uh, getting him talking. And when you press his back, he's got this lever on the back and his arm. Goes up and down like that, makes firing sounds, which is pretty cool. And he's a 12 inch figure, and I say there's an archer 12 inch, but he's quite hard to get hold of, and especially with all his uh, equipment. Uh, yeah, so I saw the room guard, which is brilliant. I love that, and uh, you know, never know, might in the future get him again. But it is a great toy line. I highly recommend it if you're into 90s toys. So that's just me reminiscing, really. Just wanted to say, you know, great film, great toy line. There's quite a few bits to it, ranging from McDonald's toys up to more expensive ones. So uh, look out for them if you wish to collect them. Thank you for watching and... Uh, See you in the next video.